There's Kobe McEwen. He sent that game into overtime with that last second three at Hinkle Fieldhouse. He'll try the three again, and he hits again. McEwen working against McDermott. That's a tough shot, but he got the kind home roll. Sent from behind the arc for the junior from White Plains, New York, the transfer from Duke. Starting to find his footing as Zakar Annam, who had 22 in the first meeting against Butler. It's a Final Four caliber team with no weakness. Nice play off the inbounds. Brendan Bailey. Cut. Marcus Howard likes to shoot from deep, and he hits. John, the skip, open, Bailey three. Sakar Annam on the push. Bailey, step back three, his second. Chased by Aaron Thompson. He'll shoot over oh, Thompson man. and hit. Got to catch the breath. Johnson inside for two. Interior Butler. A little more Jace Johnson on the floor of late for Marquette. Jace Johnson paying big dividends being on the floor with a two-hand flush there. Trying to cut off the penetration. Baldwin elevates. Shot very similar to the one that downed Nova on Wednesday night. Step back for Bailey to answer Brendan. Kevin, he, the last step he took into the space of Theo John negating his ability to block the shot. Butler needs a lot more of that here to close this deficit. And jumps it back out to McEwen. The three falls for Kobe McEwen. He's got 10 well, to play. Val Jordan is asking, how is that not a foul? And then the, when you get a Big East title, Kevin, you have that for the rest of your life. McEwen, back-to-back -back threes. Kobe McEwen. McEwen, oh, he's feeling it. Lost the handle on the ball, gets it back, trickles it to Bailey. Oh, the play! In terms of being supportive, cast on the offensive end. Howard, open three. 